Hello, I'm Penny St, and I'm the host of Peace with Penny. In Tuesday's episode of Peace with Penny, we have the pleasure of speaking with Yehuda Stolov of Interfaith Encounter Association, or IEA. The IEA provides hope and works to build bridges between Jews, Muslims, Christians, and others based on tradition and culture without any political agenda. The IEA was founded 21 years ago, has 119 groups, hosts 4,300 events and encounters, and has 4,000 people participate each year. From the Upper Galilee to Elat, are you surprised to hear that Israelis and West Bank Palestinians meet on a regular basis? Within the groups, participants have meaningful exchanges which bring them closer to each other. Prejudice, hostility, and suspicion are transformed into direct relationships, mutual respect, and friendships. But are you curious why I care about this conflict halfway around the world? I'm Jewish, and that's part of it, but let me explain. It was the summer of 2014, and for my son's bar mitzvah present, just like many Jewish parents, we wanted him to bond with the Holy Land. Oh, it worked perhaps too well. My husband had stayed back at the hotel, and our friends, my son and I, had just stopped in a pharmacy. Run! Run to the bomb shelter, sweetie! Please! Please hurry! I didn't hear the sirens at first, but the Israelis did. They're used to hearing these things. We ran to the back of the storeroom. It was a 12 foot by 24 foot windowless bomb shelter. My heart's pounding. Boom! Boom! I hear it and feel the percussion of the exploding bombs. I'm trying not to get sick. I look at my 13 year old son and I think I'll never forgive myself if something happens to him. That's an excerpt from a speech I gave to the Orange County Jewish Bar Association. It was the first but not the last time we had to run to a bomb shelter. Our adventure and my transformation is also the subject of my book, Blasted from Complacency, A Journey from Terror to Transformation in Israel. There is no chapter in a parenting book on what to do when a war starts and you're on a family vacation. Think touring extraordinary and sacred sites mixed with cowering in bomb shelters. I'm still trying to get over the Jewish guilt of taking my son to war for his bar mitzvah present. The impact of being human targets helped me understand the plight of Israelis living like this, and it also made me want to work on peace. How Israel is often described on the news is not what I'd seen with my own eyes. And I felt Palestinian parents also preferred their children playing safely in their backyards. The missiles exploded just near enough to blow apart my world as I knew it, forever changing me. And you'd never recognize my life today with what it was like then. I believe I found my life's purpose. We hope you can join us. The IEA invites people from different traditional and cultural backgrounds and faiths to join their groups, learn together, and to appreciate each other. We hope you will join us and hear about their work to bring closer bonds between people into the world. You can always see the recordings for all of our episodes on our Peace with Penny YouTube channel or at our website at www.penny, the letter S, tee.com under podcasts. Thank you, and may you live in peace, shalom, and salam.